Hello and welcome. This is Kinexa style numerical test tutorial video. In this tutorial, I'll show you how you solve problems with the unknowns using basic linear equations. So let me show you the problem. So here you have a data set or data table on which this question is based. So the data table contains uh, information on components and fees of some online course. So here you can see three components, tutorials, webinars, and quizzes. And then here's the total cost per level of the course. So there are five stages or levels of the course. So for each level, there are a certain number of uh, tutorials, webinars, and quizzes. And then you've got a total cost. Now, uh, the question is uh, concerned with level B course here, and it says for level B course, one quiz hour costs three times as much as one webinar hour, and one webinar hour costs twice as much as one tutorial hour. How much does the webinar cost per hour? So uh, in order to show you the solution, now uh, I need to move to the whiteboard. Now, the first step in trying to solve such a question is to understand the relationship between these variables that, that they are mentioned in the question. For example, you know, in level B course, you've got, you know, you've got tutorials, webinars, and quizzes, and there's a set number of hours here, right? So one quiz hour costs three times as much as one webinar hour, and one webinar hour co uh, costs twice as, mu as much as one tutorial hour. So we need to uh, try and mark these um, um, uh, unknowns. For example, uh, you've got you've got quizzes, right? So how many? What's the relationship uh, to the webinars? It's it costs three times the webinars, right? And then you've got webinars, and they are twice uh, as costly as tutorials. So note that this Q stands for quiz here, W stands for webinar, and T stands for tutorial. So, you know, we've marked the relationship. And note that I can actually rewrite Q in terms of T. So that would be Q is 3 times W, right? That would be 3 times, um, instead of W, I write 2 T's, okay? So that would be 6 T, okay? six times t. Now the total here is given here 690. What you need to work out is the webinar cost per hour. Note that these are the number of hours for each so you need to multiply them by these respective you know numbers in order to you know, equate them to 690 here. So here's what I mean. So you've got 22 tutorials right? 22 times what? Tutorials right? 22t plus 3 um, you've got webinars, but one webinar is 2t, right? So it's going to be 2t, okay? And plus, you've got quiz. And quiz is, remember, it's how many t? 6, right? So it's going to be 3 times 6t. That's going to be equal to $690. And when I actually... You know, add them up, obviously it's going to be 22t plus 6t plus 18t. So that's equal to what? That equals to 690. 22 plus 6 is 28, 28 plus 18 is 46. So 46t equals 690 and t is equal to what? 15, right? So 15 times that is going to be 690. So, you know, this is the cost per hour of a tutorial. But we need is, what we need is webinar cost per hour. Remember, webinar cost per hour was 2 times t, right? So it's going to be 2 times 15. That would be 30. In other words, $30, right? So the cost is $30. Now, let me move back to the slide. Now, as you can see, the, the, the correct answer is 30, right? It's in, in marked in D. So the cost per hour of webinar is $30. And that's it. 